Last week, UCSB student Lucas Ransom died off Surf Beach in Lompoc. He was attacked and killed by a 16-foot great white shark. CPTV reporter Aaron Bevan has the story. Thanks, Tyson. Lucas Ransom was a loved family member and friend. Recently in Isla Vista, hundreds attended Lucas' Lucas's vigil to honor him one last time. 19-year-old Lucas Ransom, UCSB chemical engineering student, brother and son, is remembered and honored in the candlelight vigil. So tonight's uh, just about thinking about him, all that he did for you, how he touched your life. Travis Ransom, Lucas's brother, remembers how special he was. Luke, that kid was just in love with life. He, uh, he was the definition of living life to the fullest. Uh, it's, that's what he stood for. I mean, he passed away doing that, lo living in the ocean, loving it, enjoying every minute of it. So he really loved life. As a roommate and friend, Lucas touched and enhanced those who knew him. Uh, we would have deep conversations about our pasts and our futures, the girls we once loved, and the imaginary ones we wanted to marry and start a farm with. <laughs> Last week, Lucas Ransom was bodyboarding at Lompoc's Surf Beach. Ransom was attacked and killed by a great white shark 100 feet offshore. And a shark? I guess that's the only way a legend should go out, is in a legendary way. I've heard about, you know, shark killings, like here and there, but for somebody so close to us, and so it, it's really crazy. I think it's really impacted a lot of students. Despite feeling sorry for Lucas's friends and family, many Central Coast surfers are still heading out into the water. But, I don't know, I feel kind of safe out here because I've lived out here for the last two and a half years. This is where I learned how to surf, so it's not that bad to me. Hundreds of people gathered Oceanside in Isla Vista to pay tribute to Lucas. Lucas lived larger than life and will always have a large place in his family and friends' hearts. Reporting for CPTV, I'm Aaron Bevan. It's clear to me Lucas was loved and loved so many. Talking to many of his family and friends that night at the candlelight vigil, it gave everyone a chance to say goodbye properly. From all of us here at CPTV, our thoughts and prayers go out to the Ransom family. Tyson, back to you.